Hi you guys, Joffrey Dior back in action. I know I haven't been making videos, it's been a while, been really busy working, swamped, just trying to get everything together, you know, so stay on the lookout for me. Um, I'm going to try to at least get you guys a video once a week, hopefully everything will go through, you know, it's get hard trying to edit videos and things like that, but today I really just wanted to talk about springtime haul. I wanted to do a springtime haul actually and showcase some things that I bought over a couple of months so far and we're just gonna jump right into it um I bought these shoes from Urban Outfitters I like this shoe because it's very versatile it could be more casual or you could dress up the look with this shoe and the color is very neutral so it's not like a big wow factor it won't overpower the outfit it'll just go right along with the outfit and it has this like suede material it was only forty dollars urban outfitters forty dollars my new favorite footwear is this leopard flat I actually purchased this shoe from traffic it was only twenty five dollars and what I really like about this is the print Prints are in for springtime, but what I've realized and what I've seen are people are kind of scared to wear prints. I feel like this print is a very neutral color. Like, you could color block with the outfit, and you could wear this print, this kind of print, leopard, and it'll go great with any other color, anything like that. I really agree. It was only $25. Great purchase. Great, great purchase. So, you guys need to check traffic out. Here we have my other new bee. It's um more of like coral salmon color suede material again. I bought it from Bare Feet with twenty dollars, and I like this shoe because it has a, like a ballet flat, and it gave it more of a casual, but it has that wow factor to it, like. It was very powerful. When I saw it, I was like, oh my god, I have to buy it. I have to, have to buy it. And I just loved the color, and it was a great price. Bare feet, $20. Great, great, great price. Next, we have bottoms. And when I was looking for bottoms, when it comes to me shopping for bottoms, actually, it's like I try to go for versatile, something that I could wear throughout the day and then it could go into a nighttime look without it looking oh that's supposed to be a daytime look no it could be a daytime and nighttime look and I want more bang for my buck so you guys know I like to save a little coins here save a couple of dollars there um we're gonna first start off with these pants that I have here I actually really enjoy these pants they're more of like a metallic gold color and then they have like a blue shimmer to it like a baby blue shimmer to it and what i really like about this is the material they're like a cotton and spandex material so they stretch a little bit and then they're soft and what i really really enjoy is like how the lighting is on these pants like at nighttime the color the blue you can see more depending on the lighting and in the daytime it actually just like glistens in the sun and I think that's like so cool it gives you that wow oh my gosh type factor going on and I feel like it could be a color it could be a pants that females and males as well if they're daring to go down that route for the springtime it's very versatile and I really really enjoy this forever 21 purchase Forever 21 and I bought it for like $15 they were really really cheap and I feel like I could get them a lot of wear out of them now we have these like sky blue denim jeans sky blue denim I really like the color because it's a soft color and it works well going from spring into summer because that's what I'm trying to get people to understand colors are Big spring and summertime. Don't be afraid to wear colors. Colors are good for you guys. And I really like these because they are more of like a subtle calming. But they're still the whole wow factor. 
It's not too much, but it's not too little, you know? And I actually bought these from Play-Doh's Closet. They were $10. $10. I know, wow, it's like, oh my god, $10. <laughs> but I really, really enjoy these. Next, we have more of a hot, oh my god, it's hot, I don't feel like wearing clothes type bottom. These are shorts that I actually got from Cotton On. They were only like $15. And I love the color going on with these shorts. They're like a mint green. And these are more of like a beach look. I will wear these to the beach. Or if it's really, really hot and then it has that breeze going on. And you don't want to be cluttered with clunky clothes. Because I don't feel like people should wear clunky clothes during spring and summertime. These are a great, great, great look. Great choice. Play-Doh's. I like Play-Doh's because I mean cotton on. $15. Cotton on. Cotton on. Colors, you guys. As I so, so am demanding about these colors, when I bought these pair of capri pants, actually, I was trying to look for a color-blocking outfit, trying to find something wow but bright and still sophisticated at the same time. I wanted a classy look, something clean, put together, things like that. It is blue. Yay for the blue. I think these pants are really, really cool because they're not too heavy of a material. I feel like this is another versatile day and nighttime look. And it gives you business and fun at the same time. Business and play. Who wouldn't want that? Work, play, work hard, play harder, duh. <laughs> and I like the little double button action going on. See, double button, double button. Forever 21, once again, I think that's like one of my favorite stores because great fashion afford clothes for discount prices. Blue capri pants, springtime, summertime, day and nighttime look. Who wouldn't want a pair of pants that you could work with throughout the year? More bang for your buck. <laughs> Now we're going to go into tops. When I was really looking for tops, it was more of a spring look. Because, you know, in the spring it's still a little bit chilly. The wind is blowing, even though the sun is starting to come out more. The wind is blowing, still a little bit chilly. So, And I was trying to do the more color, 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 color. Because I'm big, as you guys all know. Color is my thing. First we have this green it's a bright green button up I actually bought it from express it was twenty dollars it was on sale actually it was originally priced at i believe like thirty dollars it was twenty dollars and i really like this shirt because the outfit that i was going for was the cold color blocking so i paired this shirt this item with the blue um capri pants and i thought the look was awesome i will post a picture up and let you guys see that but i really like this shirt because it's lightweight it's not too heavy of a material and the fact that it gave me the whole wow but put together outfit and you know who actually really inspired me was lala in that episode that she wore i think it was a green button up and or orange blazer. I thought that was like so hot. And I just felt like, oh my god, I feel like I can rock that look. I can really rock that look. But I feel like color blocking pieces are awesome. Because matching nowadays is like kind of boring. And I feel like if you could put two contrasting colors together and still make the outfit look good, like, oh my god, you're awesome, we're awesome people. <laughs> Next we have this denim shirt. Um, I got this shirt from, where was it? Play-Doh's Closet, once again, Play-Doh's Closet, new favorite thrift store. I mean, I go to Goodwill, but Play-Doh's Closet is more there for me, you know? It's lightweight denim. It's not too heavy. It's a Levi brand shirt. And I bought it for, I believe, like $10. It's 
it was ten dollar and i like this shirt because of the material going on also and the fact that you know most denim shirts are like heavy and clunky this is very soft and lightweight and i can wear it when the sun is out and not be too hot like oh god i need to take this shirt off it's like sweating and i'm really hot no this shirt is very cool cool material and it could work in warm or extremely hot weather plato's closet levi brand and it was fifteen dollars actually ten dollars oh now we have these shirts, these last two shirts that I'm about to show you guys are like my new favorite, favorite shirts. Even though I don't really wear them as often. But I love the material about them. They're very lightweight, cool. And then one of the shirts is very versatile as I am so persistently trying to get you guys to understand. Versatile day and nighttime look. So the shirt, the first one is a like button up. But with no sleeves, it's a sheer chiffon material. Actually, is black in the front and cream in the back. And it has a little tight bow up thing. It's more of a tunic, but when I wore when I purchased this shirt, I was like, I'm going to wear it as a shirt rather than a tunic. But I really like this because of the material and it's very lightweight. And the fact that I can wear it in the blazing hot sun and look amazing like a million dollars is like so awesome to me and the fact that this whole two-tone color blocking with the nude color and the black is really really hot i actually purchased this from forever 21 and it was about 17 dollars i believe 17 dollars and i really really love this shirt you guys should check them out. They do have like a whole lot of selections of chiffon shirts in for the springtime. My next item is this purple chiffon long sleeve. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> I really, really like this because of the color. It's more of a daytime and nighttime color because of the fact that it's a dark but not too bright it's bright but not like oh my god girl what she got on like are you serious no it's purple purple means royalty so i guess i could say i'm a little bit of royalty <laughs> but i really like the fact that it gave you business and play with the whole collar action going on and the fact that it's long sleeve and it's buttoned up and you could work well with this shirt I prefer, I think this would be hot for a female to wear a shirt like this with like a high-low skirt and mm, color blocking. But I could say you could pair this shirt with a black bottom because the shirt is very bold and bright and it makes a definition by itself. But Chiffon Forever, no, actually I got this shirt from Sirens. If you guys never heard of them, they're like, um... I will compare them to mm, a little bit of Forever 21 and Wet Seal mixed together. But it was actually $10. Everything in that store is like $10. They all have like a sale. Anything $10 will be $5. Anything above $10 will be $10. So I really like to go to that store because they have very good items like this. And for cheap, cheap prices. Who wouldn't want to buy an outfit for cheap prices? Now we have accessories. As people know, Joffrey Dior loves accessories. Yay! My favorite, favorite part of this haul, accessories. I actually have this piece on that I bought from the Goodwill. It was, I believe, like $7. And I really thought it was like a wow factor. It's more of an ethnic type necklace going on. It gives you African and a little bit of Bohemian mixed into it. First, we have these bangles that I purchased. They're colored bangles, as you guys can see. 
And I like these bangles because the fact that they're gold and they have color in them. And I feel like I could wear them in the day and nighttime. I'm always thinking about how much of a wear can I get out of buying an item. I wouldn't want to buy a $50 shirt or $200 pair of shoes that I know I'm only going to wear like one time. You want to get more bang out of your buck. These are really fun, flirty. They give you a bohemian vibe going on with the color and the design on how they're cut, actually. This one has like a swirl going on. This one's more of like a flat, but it's still swirl action going on. This one's flat all around, and it has colored jewels in it. I think that's like so awesome. And this is my favorite one. It has like this whole wrap vein thing going on. And then it has like the little accents of the beads in the front. I think that's so hot. Um, next we have this piece that I love, love, love to death. I actually got it as a gift from my cousin from Paris. And what I really like about this is that it's a clunky but it gives you that wow factor and it's a neutral color and i'm big on neutral because i can pair this with something that i can color block with and it won't look too overpowering with the outfit and i love the whole feel of it and this little plate leaf action going on here it gives me very flintstone but modern age then now we have this like bejeweled string, bead, whatever you want to call it, necklace. I purchased this one from this store called Icing. And the other two I will put in the links below. All my accessories I will put where I bought them and how much they were. Links below. Um, but this one I bought from this store called Icing once again. It was a, um, I believe it was, I think, $12.00. And I, what I really like about this is that it's very dark colored, but it has a shimmer. Like, the colors are there, but they're subtle at the same time. It's not, like, a bright, bright color. So, I could wear this with other color blocking outfits. I could wear this with this shirt, actually, but I chose not to today. And I really like this because the fact, the color is dark and it's versatile once again. Then, now we have these gladiator bracelets that I actually purchased. One I got from down here, downtown Miami. They have a little boutique that I, I bought it from. It was like $5 in this one. It was from Fort Lauderdale, downtown Fort Lauderdale. Same thing, $5, a little boutique of downtown Fort Lauderdale. And I really like the whole heart. And then it's like a definition factor, like... Everybody can't really wear this or they don't know how to piece this together. And I think these are like really, really hot. And they're in. I've seen a lot of people like Kim Kardashian. She loves big gaudy pieces. And this is like a part of her collection even though she doesn't style her own self. But don't tell nobody I said that. <laughs> but I really like these pieces. And I think... They can go with a lot of different looks. And they're versatile once again. My next new baby is this more ethnic, earth tone vibe kind of bracelet. It actually says, fashion your passion on it. Fashion your passion. You know, I love to say fashion your passion. And I want to get that to you guys. Fashion your passion. I like this because of the whole brown action. It's very like... More of a hippie look, kind of, sort of. It gives you calm vibes, cool vibes, like, everything is going right. I will pair this with, like, a plaid shirt, like, a dark-colored plaid shirt, and some Converse. This is more like a down day, but it's still fashion-forward. I feel like you could work with this. These are, I will put age-wise, because I'm trying to get out to... Age appropriate, how do you say, yeah, age appropriate clothing and accessories. And I think these are like really, really cool. Um, necklaces. 
I love, 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 love necklaces. The first one we're going to start off with is my new favorite, but I've worn it a couple of times so far, but my new favorite is this more like salmon colored beaded stringy necklace and it's like um bohemian vibe it gives me a bo bohemian vibe very big clunky colorful oversized it's a definition piece i would wear this with like a simple white button up something or a cream colored shirt or if i want to contrast the colors i would do like a blue or a purple maybe green because it's springtime and we want to wear colors. I don't know why people are so scared of colors, but I think that's like so hot. Love this. Love, 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 love this. Next we have this more tribal Aztec Cherokee Indian kind of um, necklace going on. It has the same little chain effect here. I think that's what I'm into now. And I like this because of the colors. It's not like a gold but it's not like a bronze it's a little bit in between and then some of the beads actually are a different color as you can see like you have some purple ones some black ones and i really like this about this piece and i feel like it can be a definition piece depending on how you wear it the next piece we have here is more of a black bow tie type look going on Females, females, females. I like this piece for you guys because you could, I believe you could wear this with a non-collar shirt and a collar shirt. And it has the whole string thing going on. What I really liked about this was actually the braiding effect that it has right here with the, um, the black and white. The whole little braiding effect. I think that's like so hot. Um, I actually bought this piece from Forever 21. It was $12. And I thought this was like very cool. It's not something you see on your everyday basis. I want you guys to check me out. I have more in store. Um, Facebook, Twitter, Joffrey Dior. Twitter, at Dior, D-I-O-R-E. Facebook, Joffrey Dior. And I just got into Tumblr. So, you guys, check me out on my pics on Tumblr. FashionYourPassion.tumblr.com um, I have more in store, so you guys stay on the lookout. Reach out, put it on the man. Does you wanna see these clothes on me? Put it on.